I don't know what keeps getting hit. So this is gonna be like three videos. Let me try to go through here again. All right, we're in the upper level. Laminate wood flooring. It's more, it looks like wood, it's laminate. The little break. Stairs going down to the garage, coat closet, entry. Here's the kitchen. Kitchen is open to the dining space. Here's the dining room space, living room, kitchen. It looks very nice, very nice. From the other side of the kitchen, living down to the other level. We have two bedrooms up here. Good size bedroom. You could have a full size bed in here, no problem. And a walk in closet. And then I bet you the master is over here, but they do share a bathroom. The master, right here, and the bedroom over there share that bathroom. What I would do is I'd probably suggest you make it an office, coat closet. Master looks over the back, very beautiful yard. I would say make this the master bedroom, fits a queen size, king size bed, a dresser, nice walk-in closet, have the bathroom. But then I would use the other bedroom as an office or craft room. Beautiful tile bath, nicely done. Okay. Skylight, looks in good shape. Linen closet. Okay, so this is the upper level and I would make this my office. And then have your family room or your living room formal dining right here. Then I would go downstairs to the family room right here, beautiful family room with the nice new fireplace front, built-ins, and I'll scan it for you here. Go over here, and I would make these this one, the guest bedroom, because it could fit a large bed with a walk-in closet. And then this, I would make another bedroom. So I'd have my bedroom separated from the master. Here we have the laundry and a, a three-quarter, uh, that means a sink, toilet, shower, and this is a shower insert. And then we have a linen closet here for your company. And then I would keep the laundry like it is. Here's the laundry with the tiled floor and the additional shelves. All right. This is where the furnace and the water heater are. Down on the lower level. So this is like a raised ranch, and then there's the permit receipts on those. AC 2004, and I can't read the other one, 2013 for the heat. Okay, can't see the permit on that one, but it looks in good shape. Okay, let's go uh, look at that backyard one more time. Oh, and a crawl space here underneath the, underneath the entry additional storage space. So you could put in this area a card table or something if you like to do puzzles in the family room. Flooring looks nice, the wall color looks nice, the condition of the home seems nice. I'm gonna do one sweep out here because it got cut off the first time I tried the video. Got a large paved deck, access to the garage, has a raised 
uh, tiered found foundation feature here with this everything appears to be sloping properly away from the house beautiful backyard those two lower level bedrooms face this way and there's the AC unit this is the shed it's a great gardening shed everything looks nice got some mountain views and then we'll do the front I'll get the garage one more time I think not sure if that was on this one before it cut out. And here is the garage. Like I said, it's deep. It has enough space to add a bench and the access door to the backyard. We'll head out. And do one little sweep again when you come in garage coat closet out to patio upstairs master suite another bedroom kitchen and dining downstairs family room laundry room another bathroom and two bedrooms let's go check the front i love this detail here it looks very cool and they've done a lot of stamped concrete work. It's a beautiful neighborhood and the house looks great. And then there's that feature there. Okay, talk to you soon.